One one. That's a tough play. Kershaw off the mound. Gloves rips and got him to end the inning and gets around a hit and a walk. One two pitch. Another strikeout four on the night. There's a strike and that is now three strikeouts over the last four outs picked up by glass now. Just pounded by the bat of bets. Strikeout number four for glass now. Walks basically the same. Turner went around. And striking out the side is glass now. Here in the third. Let his starter go a little longer than the Rays do typically. Another strikeout for Kershaw. And he has done exactly what you thought he might after getting out of that. Two on one out jam of the first settled in. Nobody has reached since. His first time up, they play him to pull infield and outfield. And he pulls one into right center. Back at the track at the wall it is gone. Bellinger makes it to nothing. Dodgers here in the fourth of game one. Here comes the uh, foot tap. I guess the shoulder's okay, John. The shoulder's okay, but that should be their celebration from now on. He wants it. Uh oh. He passed you, John. There it is. He will go on to be the all time leader, I'm sure, before this series is done. It is on. Here's a shot into right. Back at the wall. It is gone off the bat of Kiermeyer. Gliding around the bases as he has broken up that string of 13 straight and cut the Dodger lead in half here in the fifth. There he goes. No throw. That is a stolen base. And now again, and this time officially, Mookie Betts has stolen the first base of the 2020. World Series. Now he's their cleanup hitter. He grabs the first. Throw home and not in time. Around the tag is Betts. Good time. Great base running by Mookie Betts, and it's three to one Dodgers here in the fifth inning. Runner goes and a shot into left center field for a base hit. And the score is Seeger going first to third is Muncie and the Dodgers. Open up a four to one lead and they just keep on turning the crank. Yarbo trying to keep it a three run game and he cannot. Base hit by Taylor. Muncy scores and it's five to one here in the fifth inning of game one. Hard hit left side base hit. Here comes Smith. Here's the throw. Not in time. Another run. And a pinch hit RBI single for Kike Hernandez. He's made it six to one here in the fifth. And he is greeted by Betts. A shot into right back at the wall. And it's gone. One pitch, one more run. And the first Dodger postseason home run for Mookie Betts. Seven to one. Well, there's that first pitch swing I was talking about. He tried to do it now in the fourth at bat, and the ball does carry to right field here. One out, Muncie at the plate. He hits a rocket into right center field. That will not be caught. Short hops the wall. Turner cruises to the plate. It's an RBI double for Muncie, and the Dodgers' carousel keeps on turning. There's one down in the inning, and a line drive into right, a base hit. One run scores, they will hold the runner Wendell at third, and it's first and third. A run in, an 8-2 game, and only one out in the seventh. Dave Roberts hoping. Here's a line drive base hit by Kiermaier. And the score is Wendell. Bottom of the order doing damage. And Zunino, the number nine hitter, will step to the plate in a five-run game with only one out. That is caught. Unbelievable double play. And the inning is over. That 
is well hit into left center field. Back is Bellinger on the track. He's got it. A catch and a smile by Cody Bellinger. A catch and frustration for Austin Meadows. One out in the ninth. He was outstanding. Here's one off the hand of Kelly. Seeger got it. And the ball game is over. 1-6-3, and Kelly looks no worse for the wear. A three-hour, 24-minute game. Got to change with Brandon Lau. If it changes, I think the Rays have a chance. And a shot in the left center. Back at the wall, it is gone. Lau has put the Rays on top as he busts out. With a first inning, game two, home run. Blake Snell, 27-year-old left-hander from Seattle, year two of a five-year deal. And he signed that deal coming off a Cy Young award-winning season. One-two pitch is swung on and missed. There, strike three. Turner didn't agree. Here comes a 2-2 from Floro, and a grounder to short. Throw home by Seeger, and that was easy. Force out or tag at the plate as sliding up short of the plate was the runner, Margot. And with the infield in, I mean, it just doesn't get any easier. And takes strike three. A strikeout ends the inning. Ready to go. Strikes out here, and that's number five on the night. Beauty by Snip. Runners at first and second. Opportunity, a one. That's in to right center. And to the wall. One run scores. That's Choi. Margot all the way around. And Wendell has delivered. It's 3-0 Tampa Bay here in the fourth. Your delivery is swung on and missed. Completely healthy. Boy, he has been just nasty here tonight for the Dodgers in the bottom of this fifth inning as they're still looking for their first hit. That's pretty well hit in the left. Back at the wall. It is gone. Second of the night for Brandon Lau. And this is a five to nothing game here in game two. To two and another strikeout. Taylor hits it well into right. Back at the track and the wall. Goodbye. Dodgers are on the board. Their first hit, their first two runs. And it's 5 2 here in the fifth. That's going to be all for Blake Snell. He hadn't given up a hit, had struck out nine, had two outs, nobody on in this fifth. Walked Hernandez. Taylor, the number nine hitter, got him on a home run to right. A walk to Betts. A hit by Seeger. And Blake Snell will exit. And a strikeout ends the threat. On the way from Kelly. And a line drive. What a good at bat. Base hit into right center, and G-Man Choi has his first World Series hit. That's into left field. Choi is going to tag. Taylor with a catch. Choi scores back to first as Margot, and this is a 6-2 ball game. They are huge. Here's one driven in the air to left. This ball is gone. Will Smith, his first hit of the night, and his first World Series home run. 6-3 ball game here in the sixth. Around those bases, he had to feel like, ooh, right-hander. That Snell had me all tied up. 1-2. Hit in the air to center. Back at the track. It is gone. Another one for Seager. Absolutely red hot this postseason, and Corey Seager has his seventh. This is a two run game here in game two in the eighth. 
Left side. It is a fair ball. Turner won a play, but not in time. Infield hit for a Rosarena. And he's got his first hit of this World Series. Turner did all he could do. Power and speed. The leg speed out this ball. The power of that young man comes from his legs. And now we will have a pinch runner as Hunter Renfro comes off the bench and he'll do the running for Diaz. Or rather, Rosarena come out. And a side saddle on the rubber brings it home. And he we went to the ball game's over. Taylor strikes out. And the Tampa Bay Rays have even this World Series in a game of peace. That is dirty. Here's one shot into left. Back at the wall. It is gone. Justin Turner has put the Dodgers on top in game three. Right-hander Walker Buehler. Uh, something the Rays are really going to be challenged. Lead-off batters do not hit Buehler. Hey. Just filthy. <laughs> Inning is over. Here's a one-two. That hey. just slides into the strike zone. But that's a <laughs> that is into right center field and will score two. Max Muncy delivers with two out here in the third inning. Seeger and Turner score, and it's 3-0 Dodgers here in the third. And there it is, the bunt. One scores. Can't stop it, I'm telling you. And it's 4-0 on a perfect bunt by Austin Barnes. Six RBIs this postseason. Ground ball, make it seven. Here comes Peterson, another run for the Dodgers. They lead five to nothing, and it's another two-out run for L.A. Nasty down and in, and that breaking ball tight. Strikeout number six. The Rays tomorrow night. There's a strikeout. That is down into the corner, and the Rays are on the board. Margot will score. Adamas content with a double, two doubles in the inning, and it's a five to one ball game. That is a shot into left center field. Back at the wall, it is gone. A bunt for an RBI, and now Austin Barnes shoots one out into left center, and it's six to one Dodgers here in the sixth. Good. Strikeout number eight. He caught it. There's the strikeout. Struck him out, and that is 10 on the night. The Dodgers have put up six runs on nine hits, but the story tonight is that guy. That is hammered down the line, and Rosalina goes deep. And that ties a record. His eighth home run of this postseason. Right down the line, and a Rosarena just crunched it. It's six to two. Strong as he could be, because he lost a bunch of weight when he dealt with the symptoms. Here's one in the left. That ends the ball game, a final of six two. And we get to finish the Rosarena story tomorrow night. Yes, we do. Tune in, everybody. Here's the next, and a high fly ball into center. Back at the track, at the wall, did it again. Back-to-back -back nights. Justin Turner with a first inning, two-out solo shot. And the Dodgers lead one to nothing in game four. You know, this year he had been he'd been struggling against breaking balls, especially sliders. In his career he hasn't, but this year he struggled. 
Seager hits one in the air to right. This ball is crushed and gone. Corey Seager with another two-out RBI as he circles the bases with his eighth home run of this postseason. That tie is for the record with a Rosarena and three others, and it's 2-0 Dodgers here in the third. Good luck, Boots. Barnum from a teammate, some cowboy boots in Mexico, and here is a shot into right center field. This ball is back at the wall, and he's got another, and the all-time record for home runs in a single postseason with number nine. More importantly for the Rays, it's a two-to-one game. That is hitting to right a base hit. Seager is brought around third. Throw by Renfro. Has a great arm, but it's up the line. Safe at second, and now out as Muncie falls off. It's a three-to-one ball game, and Muncie pleading his case. Here is the three-two, and a high fly ball into left. This ball is up and way out of here. It's a 3-2 game as Hunter Renfro gets his first of the World Series. That's the reason to go to a 3-2 breaking ball. This guy does not change his swing no matter what the count is. And you mentioned all the homers he hits off the left-handers. That is past Brasso and in the left. And the score is Will Smith. Stopping at third is A.J. Pollock on a two-out RBI hit by Kike Hernandez. It's 4-2 Dodgers. Baez brings it. And a high fly ball into left center field. Back at the wall. It is gone. Brandon Lau has put the Rays on top with a three-run home run the other way. It's 5-4 Tampa Bay here in the sixth. What a swing and what a pitch selection that they went with with a guy who really struggles against change-ups. They went with the fastball and he went with it. And the Rays have really got their dugout in a frenzy. That is off the glove. Two runs are going to score, and now Bellinger trapped in a rundown, tagged out, but Peterson is delivered off the bench. A two-out, two-run pinch hit on a knock into right, and the Dodgers are back on top here in game four. Swing and a miss to go 0-1. Here's one into right. This one is way out of here, and game four is tied. Kiermaier touches one off into right. Seager, a little flare, shallow left. Dodgers back on top. Another two out run scoring here in the eighth. Shattered back fly ball. Kiermaier ends up with the handle of his bat in his hands. His bat in pieces and the ball falls in shallow right center. And the tying run is on with one out. Runner goes, 3-2 and bounces in there. Smith locates it. It's two on with two out. And the Rays are going to ask for the biggest hit in the life of Brett Phillips. Traded to Tampa Bay from Kansas City. Two strikes. Jansen. That is into center field. Here comes Kiermaier. Phillips has tied the game. A Rose Arena coming around. Throw home. Now he stumbles. But the ball gets away. Tampa Bay wins it.
hit eight home runs. That is a base hit into right. Here comes Betts. Here's the throw. Dodgers take a first inning lead. What a start. The gas tank. There goes Muncy on a ground ball. Nice play loud. No play for an out. And it's 2-0 Dodgers. And the base running of Corey Seager just made it 2-0. That is well hit into left center field. Back at the wall. It is 3-0 Dodgers. Peterson with a blast. Here's one into right field. That's going to get down. Betts can't get to it. Digging around second and now headed to third is Kiermaier. They're going to bring him to the plate. Diaz all the way to third and now a race to the base and Diaz is safe. And it's a 3-1 to one game and Yandy Diaz with a big swing of the bat for the Rays here tonight. An RBI triple. Information that was a part of what went on. That is a big hit. Pitch was up and a Rosa Reina has made this a one run game. Kershaw comes after you as a left hander. Here's the runner coming to the plate and tagged out and the inning is Margot. He's saying he got around the tag. Austin Barnes the catcher immediately heads off he thinks he got him. With his big set move, Kershaw stepped off so he didn't balk. And that's close. But no review. So the Rays, and there's the tag, the Rays had first and third, nobody out, and do not score. What a job by Kershaw. And it's still 3-2 Dodgers. I mean, you were there. Here's a high fly ball into right, absolutely belted. Muncy points at his dugout and will take the trot. Dodgers lead four to two here in the fifth. Well, two, three, and four in the Dodgers lineup is sizzling the last three games. I mean, here's a one-two pitch. A strikeout. That's the fifth of the night for Kershaw. And Kershaw is now the all-time strikeout leader in postseason play. That was 206. Little fly ball, shallow center field. Bellinger's got it. And the Rays strand a couple. And Victor Gonzalez just got two of the biggest outs of his life. Tying run at the plate. Trying it. Got him, and the Dodgers win game five. Gonsolin against Rosarena. Here's one into right. That ball will carry back at the wall and is gone. A Rosarena has put Tampa Bay on top as he flicks one into the seats and right onto the tarp. And it's one to nothing Tampa Bay as he has his 10th postseason home run. 27 years old, 6'4", 225, Blake Snell. Yeah, he's been awesome and really has a chance to quiet the power of this Dodger lineup. And a strikeout starts the night for Snell. The left-hander throws. Struck him out swinging with a high fastball. He's on all of them. He struck out the side. You can't do it any better. Down the hill he comes, got him swinging. He went up and away with a fastball, and from 2-0, and oh, he comes back to fan Will Smith. And that's four out of five batters where Snell has struck him out. Made it look easy. He has struck out five season. Boy, that was the one-two. Swing and a line drive. Caught by Wendell at third. And he went to go throw it across the diamond, but Taylor was able to hit the break two to Betts. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Went elevated fastball there. Fourth inning, a one to nothing. Ray's lead and now two out. And Alex Wood is a big reason why this has remained a one-run game. This stuff tonight just looks different. Yeah. And a strikeout is number seven. 2-2 two -two pitch. Check swing, yeah. and he went around. And a breaking ball that Zanino smothers and now gathers it in and throws the first. To take care of Turner, and that is strikeout number eight. Will Smith waiting behind him in the pitch. Swing and a miss. 
Blake Snell strikes out the side here in the fourth. Three two pitch and a check swing Snell. This is his night so far huh two two. Good pitch by Gonzalez one away. Here's a two two and a strikeout by Gonzalez. Two two pitch. Struck him out and Gonzalez strikes out the side. Try to do damage with it. It's Pollock and he picked one out. No damage. Out behind second base. Lau puts it away. One pitch. Here's one into center and the number nine man Barnes is aboard with one out in the sixth. Man, you're talking about a short leash. 73 pitches, two hits, nine strikeouts. Snell can't believe it. As Kevin Cash said, these guys need short memories and thick skin because this is the way we do it. Back to the top of the order and Nick Anderson comes into the game. Here's a 2 0. Hard hit and fair. Down the line. Hits the fence. Decking for third is Barnes. They will hold him there on a double by Betts, and the Dodgers are in business in a blink. And this one gets by Zunino. Tie game. Slider. Here's a play at the plate. Throw home too late. Dodgers lead. Betts scores. And just like that, the Dodgers are on top by one in the sixth. Overall, That's seven great. for 36. Another strikeout to Betts. High fly ball, left center. Back at the wall, and it is gone. Betts. Has made it three to one. Dodgers here in the eighth inning, Mookie with a blast into left center field. Urias. Got him looking to out. And rooting. Ownership. Andrew Friedman. Dave Roberts. And strike three. Dodgers have won it all in 2020. win finally the wait is over the Dodgers are the champions of 2020 in a year like no other where joy has been so hard to come by tonight tears of joy let them flow tonight there is joy in Mudville the curse of 88 is 88 and out the gate and the Dodgers are celebrating out of the middle of the field between home plate and the pitcher's mound, the Dodgers, for the first time since 1988, 32 seasons are the champions of baseball.